Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's See What Happens. This is Jeremy, we're playing Islands, and I am on a new island. I geared up, went out, searched around for way too long, and found myself a brand new island. Now, I haven't really been on this island. I kind of stopped when I found it, so... Let's explore together. Make sure there's nothing down here that's going to bite my butt. Oh, what's that? Less left shift. What's that? Is that just coral? I bet that could be used for something. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, there's, you know, a bird. Let's not swim out into the open water. All right, let's see what we can find down in here. Ooh, we got some cotton. Cool. Some nice trees. Oh, I went under the the world there. Let's see what this is. Ooh. Coal? Oh, nice. Alright. What's this? What's that? Ooh. Creepy cave. We'll come back for that. What's this? I haven't seen gold on the surface before. That's pretty fancy. Holy crap. Alright. And we'll come back for this in a minute. I want to do more exploring, less harvesting at present. So let's go ahead and load up our. Oh, ooh, look at you! Nice little armchair. Not a very majestic view. But that's fine. There's all kinds of stuff all over the place, though. What do we got? Ooh, American Cookery, Aesop's Fables. And all kinds of books. Holy cow. Like, they legitimately put full-on books in here. It's ridiculous. Even this is, like, 61 pages. This is a real book. Look at this. Gives a rundown. It's from what did that say? 1871? 1796? I don't know where I got any of the numbers that I said, but man, that's kind of neat. You can find legitimate books in this game. All right, well, let's be on the lookout for. I don't know. Whatever. Let's see what this is. Well, it's stone chunks. We got some pineapples. Is that corn? Oh. Oh. I don't see any animals. Oh, I spoke too soon. <laughs> There's a panther down there being sneaky. Got like a, a basin down there. That's cool. It's a nice little rainforest type place. I like it. Give me just a second, guys. I will be right back. 
Okay, sorry about that. That's going to be a pretty harsh cut. Uh, there was somebody at the door. I had to go take care of that. All right, so let's continue to see what's on this brand new island. I'm really hoping for, like, um, I don't know, structures, some sort of building. It looks like there's a, a cave right by our boat. I did see the cave when I when I parked. It's pretty noticeable. Oh. That's kind of why I parked there. I saw a cat, a mountain lion. There you are. Gotcha. Sort of. All right, well, that was fun. Orchids. Why are you in the... Alright. Well, leopard hide. Always good. I like that the music changes. It makes it a heck of a lot easier when you're getting surprised. Oh, it's foggy on this island. Alright, well, there's gotta be some nifty stuff. Hey, what's that? Oh, it's just a feather. Where's that other one? He was up here somewhere. Hey, there you are. Gotcha. Alright, well... This looks like a pretty standard island. Nothing really interesting so far. So since I'm doing this all on survival, I'm thinking what might be kind of fun is to start a game on creative as well and really get into the building and the crafting and... Uh, ooh. Wait, what's that? Uh, but really get into the building and the crafting and kind of see what this game can actually do. There's a lot of freedom to this game. And, I mean, I'm having fun exploring... What's that? Iron ore. Nice. But I would like to hone my skills at crafting a little bit more. And that's coal. So what's this? There's a sign. I'll be back with more goods tomorrow. Interesting. Okay. It looks like sand. Is that sand? Yeah. That's a big old sand dune. A little, little bit of... Oh, how deep does that go? Oh, just to... Literally right there, okay. Starfish. Some cool coral. But yeah, I would like to... I would like to see what this game really has to offer. In terms of creativity and... And all, and all that. Because I think... I think I could end up building some really great things. But as it stands, it doesn't seem like there's a whole... There you go, thank you. There's a whole lot of difference between the islands that I've seen. They're all... I don't know, they're all basically the same. And that can't be very interesting to watch. I'm having fun playing it by, you know, by all means. I'm, I'm enjoying myself. I like exploration and such, but I would also like to be entertaining, and I think maybe working on building stuff and crafting things might be a little more fun. I could even, you know, once I get better, once I get good, I could even do some fun tutorials on, hey, look, this is a thing that I built. So, I might start a game 
in creative mode and just sort of oh you scared me just sort of see what can be done I want to stay on the beach and make it all the way back around to where the boat is and then go inland some It's a nice little island, though. It's definitely chock full of resources. me and ran away. Ooh, what's this? Uh, just a... Ooh. <laughs> just some lag and a rock formation. Hmm. Is this all sand? Uh, five. Well, that's dirt. Ooh, some horses. Or, uh, I guess, a horse. Gotcha. That's one. Oh my gosh, man. There's like wildcats all over the place here. Holy crap. Wild boar, wild boar, not so bad, I don't see anything, really, that's jumping out at me, except for that cave, ooh, you know, like a little mini desert biome over there, everything's scrub brush and whatever. Hmm. Have I made it all the way around yet? I mean, this is a nice... Oh, what's that? Oh, it's just like a big rock formation. Looks like there should be a cave there, though, doesn't it? Hmm. Alright, well... Or that this whole island should be alive. <clears throat> hey, another horse. Well, we'll get back to the boat, to the ship, and then we'll see about getting into that cave. We ought to be pretty close. Little bamboo forest. Always nice. Bunch of pineapples. What kind of tree is that? I just looked like a like floating rock for a minute there. Well, not much going on. A lot of these little magic um, what is it? Magic fruit? Magic blossoms. And there's got to be something I can do with that. Like a shrine? Oh, cool. 
It's a graveyard. That's all kinds of something. Interesting. Hey, you see that? Up up over that hill there. I don't think that's my boat. Well, let's put on this new helmet. Hang on a second. Armor is 25. Holy cow. Yeah, that's a heck of a lot better. I really ought to be wearing the iron armor. I can make tons of it. Hey, what's that? Okay. Keep an eye out. It's hard when it's foggy to see what I'm up against. Oh, it's another bathroom! What do we got in here? Oh. Black cowboy boots. An owl. And another latrine. And there's my boat! Okay. Well, let's get in. Uh, let's get on the boat. I'll make myself that iron armor. And then we will go into the cave. We'll sort of scout that out a little bit, but... I don't know if I'm going to do a whole heck of a lot more in the survival portion of this game, but I I may start a concurrent but separate series where I uh, where I do a lot of creativity things, build stuff, see you know see what I can see what I can really do with this game, as I think it has a lot of potential as a as a great building game. You can build a whole bunch of neat things. I don't want to. I don't particularly want to compare it to Minecraft, but I think in, in the same vein that you can make, that people have made all kinds of just ridiculous things in Minecraft, I think you might be able to do the same sort of thing with this game. Alright, so I'm obviously... I'm obviously going to go in here. Looks like there's a whole mess of crystal in there. All right. Well, let's get back to the boat real quick. Let's maybe sleep until morning and this fog will go away. I'm here to tell you, it's irritating. But let's make that iron armor first. Yeah, this, and the Iron Armor boots, and Iron Armor pants. I guess. Is there anything in, in the foundry that's... No. Did I pick up anything? No. Okay, well, let's find that iron ore that I've... I thought for sure that I had, like, iron bars in a chest. It's gotta be around here somewhere. And it's a bunch of leather. Ah, there. Ooh, not as much as I thought. Maybe some more in another one. Nope. Nope. More nope. And nah. Alright. Let's make some cloth.
and um, wood pieces. Ah, no, help. <laughs> All right, give me just a second, guys. I'm going to find some wood pieces, and we are going to get to work on making some new armor. Wooden pieces. There we go. All right. Those will be in seven. We're going to kind of come on over here. Oh, it's literally all unlit. That's right, I filled it all up. I forgot about that. I'll take all of that, thank you. I don't have as much iron as I thought I did. I think I've left it in various places. Iron and cloth. Okay, well, you know what? Let's, uh, let's go ahead and, hmm, thought I saw something. Oh, well, let's sleep until morning real quick again. I want to get rid of all this fog. It makes it. Darn near impossible. Hey now. Ooh, look at that. Alright, so there's iron right there. Let's get some, let's dig up some iron here. That ought to do it. Yeah, there's 67 iron ore right off the bat. That should be more than enough. I wonder if instead of stick pieces, I could fuel all of my things with um, coal. Hey, whoa. Oh, yeah, no... I made it wait until morning. Forgot about that. I think they they've changed up something there. I wonder. Hey, look at that. I can use coal. I wonder if it lasts longer. It takes 10 gold or to make one gold ingot. It's crazy. Or a hundred gold pebbles. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. So, let's let that do that. Go back to hands. Take all of those. Do this number. Take all of that, and good. Now, more iron ingots. Okay, so it's just one cloth a piece, though. Okay, I'm just waiting on my iron ingots then. Luckily, I got both of those going. Thank you. I'm also stuck right there. Okay, 
That ought to be enough. I'll craft you. I'll craft you. And boots. There we go. We're going to have a whole new look before we delve deep into the cave there. I seem to have misplaced my torch. Let's go cut down a tree real quick, get some resin. And then we'll have a torch. Is that a hammer? I just cut down a tree with a hammer. Alright. also get some more wooden pieces and sticks so that I can make campfires. Hundred and twenty ought to be sufficient. Timber right into the ocean. Not a bad haul. That's a pretty good tree. Holy cow. Alright, so... There. Now, let's make a torch. Craft a torch, thank you. Let's... That's probably about it. Okay, cool. Let's get back onto this boat. Put on my new armor. Put all of the things in my inventory away. And go investigate this cave for about ten minutes or so. Let's see what, what kind of trouble we can get into. Oh! <laughs> Boy, it would help if I lit the blacksmith forge. If it didn't have a seizure doing it. So, it's all leather. This is all random. Bars and what have you. Mostly just ore and bars. That's what it seems, at least. There, sulfur chunk, flint. <clears throat> there, have some iron ore, because I'm not really going to use it right now. Hmm. Got a lot of cave mushrooms and bananas and stuff like that. You know what? I should probably cook off all of this food. Because I'll probably need food while I'm in there. Doot, doot. And on. Look at us. Very nice. Inventory, please. <clears throat> Doesn't show me... Hmm. 
Well, I guess that's alright. It doesn't really show me what my like armor you know, how I'm doing in terms of armor and stuff, you know? But I suppose that's alright. Ah, the difference between charcoal and coal. I got magic blossoms and something. I could swear I put them in one of these. Yeah, there we go. Alright. Magic blossoms. There's more raw meat to make. And five. And let's turn all of these hides into leather. And turn this cloth into, or yarn into cloth. Okay. Uh, you know, looking at this. I don't know what to do with these books. I don't know. Here. Go go in here for... Right, not right here. Go in here. Here. For now. Books. I got two maps. I don't need two maps. Well, what's the difference between the two? How do I have two maps? I'm super confused. Okay. Well, what's this other map? The other map is this island. I've done a decent job scouting it out. i got a big middle area, but, you know, I'll get to that. Okay, well. Let's put... I don't need to put... I don't need that on me. Okay, so the torch is going to go here. Yeah, that'll do. Uh, there. Take all of that. That's 20 roasted meat. 20 something roasted meat. That should be enough. Time to get to it. Bet we could do some fun stuff with this. Hmm. All right. Let's get down into the tunnels. Some glowing mushrooms, some cave ferns. Boy, it gets dark quick. Blue quartz crystals. Mm. I'll keep an eye out for the green eyed monsters. There's one, there's one, you see it? It's right there. Got him. Let's real quick turn, I don't know why I'm whispering like they can hear me, but let's turn this into a torch.
Holy cow. Okay. Boy, that's bright. Go ahead and snag a bunch of these. Always use crystal. I think it's for. There, that's a little bit better. Caves are spooky. getting harder and harder to see. I accidentally made a walking stick. That's alright. It's so dark down here. There's got to be a miner's helmet. It's probably just something that I haven't you know, a level of, of technology that I have not gotten to yet, but there's got to be like a miner's helmet or something. Oh, you were up there, you sneaky beast. Go, go, get him. Ah, he was hiding up here. That is cheating. That also kind of scared me. Is there another? Whoa! Look at this cave, guys! Holy cow! Whoa. No. Got him. Wow. Like, this is what I'm talking about, the creativity of this game. It's just... make these huge massive structures like this it's ridiculous i in a in a good way of course like it's amazing really get the a, a, wow you can really get a good look at the scale when you really light it up A whole bunch of quartz. Oh, <laughs> what's down there? And there is falling damage in this game, so I'm I'm trying to be a little bit careful. But this is amazing. This is an amazing cave, uh, like cave system, cavern. What's up here? If I was more prepared, like, if I had... Whoa, look at that! Get rid of get rid of that for a minute. Wow! Look at how cool that looks. I've, I've played a lot of survival games. I've played a lot of different crafting, survival, you know, whatever kind of games. And, I don't know, this one strikes me as... Truly, way up there in terms of quality, 
what you can do, um, all of that. I'd like to see a little bit more when it comes to bad guys, to enemies. But just look at this cave. This is awesome. I'm gonna gush about the game a little bit more. <laughs> it's just, it's great. Like, this is so cool. All right, let's, let's come back down here. And I've created a light source up there that should help out at least a little bit. Oh, and this is gonna be the end of my travels. I don't have anything really to make ladders back up. I don't want to be lost forever in here in case I do want to come back. And we're also at about 40 minutes, but look at this cave, guys. It's pretty awe-inspiring. All right, let's head back out. Just want to take a minute or two to see what we can do with the, uh, the all this quartz that we've picked up. How much did we pick up? Maybe pick up the rest of it on the way. You know, like 40 quarts. Pick up a couple more on the way out. Uh, nine more would be good. If we can get a solid 50. One. Two, three. The problem is, is that it gets rid of the light. Four. It uh, makes it harder to see. Yep, there we go. That's a good solid 50. What's this? Oh, sulfur. I bet you that could be used in the, um, uh, the, 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 the what is it? The chemistry thing. Okay, so is this sulfur too? Whoa. Saltpeter. Cool. All right, well, let's see what we can do with that. All right, let's get out here. Oh, it's foggy again. Is it foggy every day? Or is it on fire out here? Oh, no, it's just... Oh, those are the clouds. Boy, that looks like smoke, doesn't it? Okay. You know... I'm going to see something real quick. Because we've gone underground. But I didn't go through the center of this place. I want to see if there's anything, like, at the dead center of this island. Maybe something neat. Some sort of, I don't know, a structure. Anything, really. Okay. Make a turn. No, not really. Just sort of more of the same. It's a good island, though. It's got a lot of places to build something cool. Just building in the survival mode takes quite some time. I kind of want to try out creative. I have not done anything with the creative mode at all. Uh, my daughter, who likes to play a couple of the different games that I'm playing here on the stream when I'm not at home, has created a character in creative mode, and I'm curious to see what she might come up with. Sumac. Nice. Alright, well, I think that's like the whole... I mean, it's not the whole, whole island, but it's the vast majority of it. Everything in that blank spot is just over here. Sort of more of the same. Nothing's really jumping out at me. Ooh. 
<laughs> Except for that puma. There are a lot of different places on here that look like they could, they should be something. All of these weird um, rock outcroppings, I feel like if I line them up right, I'll see, I don't know, something. It feels like that should happen. You know, the way that they're up into threes and stuff, like, it's going to point me in the direction of something. They almost look like hands coming up out of the ground. All right, well, enough of that. Let's get back to the boat. Get back to the boat. We'll see what we can find out about um, what the crystals can be used for. I know it was something. I think it's for some armor. Wasn't it? Was it the, the armor that you can make with gold? I think it was like the guardian armor. Or something like that. I don't remember though. Let's find out. Oh, uh... Um, is it just a thing that I made in my hands? Ooh, some cool robes. Leather armor. Stone helmet. Yeah, there it is. Oh, yeah. Steel plate, gold ingot, copper ingot. Well, let's try that out. Let's make one of those real quick. Um, steel plate. Gold ingot, copper ingot. Uh, there's no fuel in my fire. Oh, wait, do I need... I think I can just make it, like, with my hands. I need more steel plate, but, uh... 35? 25. Oh, and I look fancy! Awesome! Okay. Well. Ladies and gents... don't think I'm going to be doing a whole lot more on this for right now. Um, I'm really, I really like this game. I think this game, this game is great. I want to try more of the creative angle though. So I think this is the last of the survival for right now. I'll probably bounce back and forth and it'll be denoted. It'll all be in the same playlist. But the ones that are creative will be, you know, Wyland's Creative Episode 1. But it's all in the Wyland's... Islands, rather. It's all in the Islands, um... Playlist. But I'll also make a separate playlist for the creative ones. Yeah. Not bad. This is a cool island. All right, guys, that is going to do it for right now. I've got my new spanky, spiffy armor. Here, that looks better. I wonder if there's, uh, man, I keep saying that's going to do it for now. But could I make, like, a better sword? No. That's weird, right? How about in here? Saber. Nope, not really. Alright. Well, that is going to do it. Let's stand on the bow of the ship. We'll kind of have everything at our back. Oh, man, that's nice. Alright, guys. <laughs> Remember to like, comment, and subscribe if you like what I'm doing. I really appreciate you guys taking time out of your busy day to come and see what I'm up to. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Bye.